What's up guys, it's Stevie. It's been so long. Sorry I haven't uploaded anything. But I was waiting for my Alba cosplay to come in so that I could make a video for you guys and it's finally here. So if you want to learn how I transform myself into Alba, just keep on watching. So the first thing that I always do is put in my contacts. I'm just putting my yellow contacts in and you guys know the drill. I'm just going to be covering my brows and putting on foundation and all that good stuff. When you're covering your brows, make sure you're doing everything very gently when you're powdering or blending or doing anything when it's covering your brows because people tend to be really rough and that's how you have your natural brows show up and that's not what you want. So just make sure when you're doing anything with your brows, you're very gentle. with a brown eyeshadow just for my base and then going in with blue shadow later you don't have to do this this is optional I just do it just so I have a base and when you're doing Alba's brows I would recommend looking up a reference picture I didn't because I was going based off my memory which didn't go out well but it still turned out okay but next time I do this I would probably use a reference picture just so the brows are exactly like his Alba is one of the most important things because you want chiseled cheeks, you want more of a slim face, and I'm doing this mainly because I went to the beach and my foundation doesn't match my skin anymore, so I'm trying to just bring some color back in. <laughs> crucial step because your eyes are kind of your focal point for this especially with me because I don't really add anything other than contour on my face so the eyes is something that I work on the most and I would just do bar liner do that little cat thing in the corner and make your wings as small but I guess somewhat thick I wouldn't make them too large just because you don't want them to look really extreme you just want it to look like Alba's eyes. I kind of 
just showed you how to do the eyeliner so I just kind of did that part off camera and now I'm going to be using a pink shadow to put underneath of my lash line I just like to do this because I like how it looks you don't have to do this and you obviously don't have to use this exact um, eyeshadow palette but I just showed it in case somebody has it and they want to use it and then don't forget to put on mascara because your lashes probably got somewhat gray maybe white from your powder or your foundation so don't forget to put mascara so that was the end of the video i hope you guys enjoyed it give it a big thumbs up comment down below what you'd like to see next and i'll hopefully see you in my next video bye guys